This might be a better shot of the blocks we built to get Eddie off the ground. We didn't have them set just right, but the tires are on there. All the weight's on there. You can see, you can see that one, all the, all the weight's down on it. But, pretty simple thing, you know. I come to my uncle's enough that we'll just store these and if I come back, boom, we'll set them out and I'm up. Instead of trying to level it with those little uh, plastic blocks, it works pretty well. And I'm going to work on, uh, I'm going to buff it out, I'm going to get some oxidizing compound and, and strip it down. The fiberglass never put that stuff on metal. And uh, see if I can get some wax on it afterwards and get it get it looking good. After doing my others on other uncles, it is not a fun job. If you have a lot of money, pay somebody to do it. But I'll just do this in sections. Alrighty, YouTubers. And as I'm out here, I'm watching the DVD I made. This is that Globe Tricker show, and they're in Eastern Canada. And I think that might be on my uh, to-do list. There are lots of neat places, Newfoundland, Nova Scotia. I've been there, but I'd like to go back. Prince Edward Island, all those, I'd like to check them out. I like the idea of Prince Edward Island. I think it's like uh, free to get over there. You can either take a ferry or drive a bridge, but it costs you like 60, 65 bucks to come back. So it's free to go, you gotta pay to leave. It's kinda neat. On my list. There's another this project summer. I worked on. I had made this in the past. Um, I have screens on these pop out windows, and I was worried that if I had the windows open, that I would kick them because the bed lays across sideways across the back, and I was afraid the animal, the cat would mess them up or something. So I got some cheap plexiglass and I cut it to fit. And what I did finally, I've been wanting to do it for a while, I finally just did it, was I took a drill and I cut holes in the plexiglass so that I'll get some ventilation. I mean, it took two seconds. I just used the, uh, the workbench, had a bunch of holes already, and I used that as a template and did both sides. So now I get a little bit more air coming through, and I still have the integrity of this you know that I'm not gonna bust the screens out and if I choose to I can always put more holes in them I could put another row across this area but it seems to be working pretty well it's getting good ventilation so now not only do I have um, the screens protected I'm also getting ventilation again so quick and easy little tip youtubers if you have windows like that a piece of plexiglass can really come in handy and protect them. Anyone with pets knows that RV pets can really mess up some screens, so a piece of plexiglass with some holes drilled in it can protect them for you. Have a great and wonderful day.